Okay, so welcome to Math Storia and let's have this topic. So finding the derivative of exponential functions. So for y equals e to the power u. So to find the derivative, that's y prime equals e to the power u times the derivative of u. So if we have this given, y equals e to the power negative 3x. So for this given, u equals negative 3x and for the derivative of u so the derivative of negative 3x that's negative 3 so to find now the derivative that's y prime equals e to the power u so we have e to the power negative 3x times du and du is negative 3 so therefore y prime is equal to negative 3 e to the power negative 3x then for this given so y equals e to the power 2x to the power 3 plus 5 so for this given u is 2x to the power 3 plus 5 then for the derivative of u, so for the derivative of 2x to the power 3, this one is 6x squared and this one is 0, so du is 6x squared. So to find out the derivative, so we have e to the power u, so e to the power 2x to the power 3 plus 5 times du and du 6x squared. So therefore, y prime, that's 6x squared times e to the power 2x to the power 3 plus 5. So this is now the derivative. Then for y equals e to the power negative cosine 3x. So for this given, u is negative cosine 3x. Then for the derivative of u, so, so we have this negative then for the derivative of cosine that's negative sine then 3x times the derivative of 3x that's 3 so therefore du so negative times negative that's positive then we have this 3 so positive 3 then sine 3x then to find out the derivative so we have e to the power negative cosine 3x times du and du is 3 sine 3x. So therefore y prime is equal to 3 then sine 3x times e to the power negative cosine 3x. So this is now the derivative. Then for this given, so for y equals e to the power 3, then tangent 5x. So u is equal to 3 tangent 5x. Then to find the derivative, so bring down this 3. Then for the derivative of tangent, this one is second squared. 5x times the derivative of 5x, that's 5. So therefore, du, so 3 times 5, this one is 15, then second squared, 5x. So to find out the derivative, so y prime equals e to the power u, that's 3 tangent 5x times du and du, that's 15, second squared, 5x. Or y prime is equal to 15 second squared 5x times e to the power 3 tangent 5x so this is now the derivative then for this given so y equals e 3 ln x so from the properties of logarithm that n ln x is equal to ln x to the power n so this n is the exponent of x so therefore we can rewrite this one as y equals e 
Then ln x, so this 3 is the exponent of x, so x to the power 3. Then from the property of exponential function, that e ln u, this one is equal to u. So we just need to cancel this e and ln. So therefore, this given y equals, so this is equal to x to the power 3. Then to find the derivative, so we have y prime equals, so the derivative of x to the power 3, this one is 3x, then to the power 2. So this is now the derivative. Then for y equals e to the power 4, then ln 3x plus 5. So again, we can rewrite this one using the property of logarithm, the power property. So we have e to the power ln, then 3x plus 5 to the power 4. So this 4 is the exponent of this equation. Then from the property of exponential function, so this one is equal to 3x plus 5 to the power 4. Then to find for the derivative of this equation, so using the chain rule, so formula for the chain rule, that's u to the power n. So to find the derivative, so y prime equals n times u to the power n minus 1 times the derivative of u. So for this given, this is u. So u is 3x plus 5 and du. So derivative of 3x, that's 3, and derivative of 5, that's 0. So du is equal to 3. So to find now the derivative from this chain rule, so we have n, n is the exponent, so we have 4 times u, and u is 3x plus 5, then n minus 1, so 4 minus 1, this one is 3 times du, and du is 3. Then simplify, so 4 times 3, so y prime is equal to 12 times 3x plus 5 to the power 3. So this is now the derivative.